All right, now we can get into this little area. This is probably just... Oh, there's some items there. Interesting, nice. Can I not register this as a location? I found the side quest where I, like, do those, by the way. And yeah, with this, I can definitely get a new reward. There's a treasure chest. Treasure wall. One of those weird writing things on the wall. I'm not really sure what those are used for. The only one I found that did anything was the one that cursed me. Also, over here seems to be a treasure down there. I love games with no fall damage. <laughs> Oops. Yep, yep. Oh. Uh, other treasure chests. There should be one over here. I love just exploring in this game. It's so far on in my mind block. Kind of wish it showed the barriers on the maps. That's one thing I kind of wish they put in. Oh well. Alright. I think this is actually part of a district I've already been to. Yeah. Oh, I didn't notice there was a, a damn canal there. No, whatever. Treasure over here. Oh, shoot. There's a wrong gut. What are you doing here? There's a goddamn treasure in there and I can't get it. It's going to be on the map bothering me for all eternity so I can actually get it. Fuck sake. Alright. Oh, okay. We have to go over here. Alright. Fine. I shall do this now. It's the bully. Uh, Alright. Listen up, you guys. Uh, <laughs> what's the biggest hurdle for protecting the peace of Balduk. Uh, of course, it's the monster. <laughs> That's right. So, you guys. Oh, and also, the, um, <laughs> that must be fun to translate. The monster that goes by the name, um, shit. Like, letting your guard down <laughs> that resides in your heart. He's basically saying your, like, your own, um, carelessness will be another of those, uh, obstacles. Uh, don't pretend, like, you don't notice this and train yourself and devote yourself to your duty. Uh, we won't tolerate any more that, like, we won't tolerate murder and, like, bad acts any more than this from now on. Yes, sir. Oh, the... <laughs> the guards are, like, really into it, huh? The prison warden guy came from Rom recently, and it seems he's uh, got a lot of popularity. It seems with this, like, even Hawk won't be able to, like, go crazy like he has been, maybe. <laughs> We're supposed to be his, um, his, like, teammates, but whatever. And, uh, why would he even, why would he even start, like, doing that murdering thing? Uh, I have no idea. He's always been that way ever since I met him. Uh, by the way, the place in the middle there is the building where I've got something to do. Let's stop by there later if it's okay. Alright, these guys are actually just there. I guess we won't get caught. Oh, crap. Oh. This building is... Um... This is the public bathhouse that... Rom had, um, built. Uh, you, like, anyone can take a bath there as long as you pay money. Uh, that's pretty... God, I hate this word. Uh, that's pretty groundbreaking, or the Rom Empire did. 
Yes, it seems that for provinces that are around Rome or that belong to Rome, they have a habit of uh, making public uh, buildings, like facilities like this. Uh, even from the beginning, the people of Baldo always liked baths. Now, there are even times when the Knights of the Church rented it out and like opened it for free for the public. And ever since then, the Knights of the Church have had a pretty good reputation in this place. Oh, you guys... Uh, oh, it's you, hello. Weren't you just in the bar? Uh, Shante, sir. <laughs> Did you guys come for a bath too? Mm, it's that's good. Bathing here will make your skin really shiny. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's right. Uh, there have even been times where I've spent a few hours in there. <laughs> I guess they're having a fun time talking about the bath. Hmm. So yeah, at all, there's times where it's good to relax both your heart and your body. Mm. So please enter, I guess, like any time he means. Okay, I was actually just here. Oh, damn it. No one's going to be able to bath with this thing in here. Alright, and we got a treasure for defeating that. That all kind of died. That seems to be a bit of equipment. Let me... Oh, shit. I turned auto on by accident. Let's see here. Oh, it's the same thing. Oh, okay. It's that. Okay. That's pretty cool. Ooh. A HP plus 150. I'll give her that. Yes. What is this? Oh, you get extra damage for us. This is the... <coughs> the spirits. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Resist curse. Okay. I'm gonna give Adol that, even though he's dead at the moment. Just ignore that. There's a tre oh, this is the treasure chest that I couldn't get. This stupid guy is blocking it. Let's go check out these marks. These exclamation marks. Alright, we can go in here. Is this the merchant building she was on about? Well, not the merchant building, the trade building. Oh, he's in here as well. Wow, this guy gets around. Yeah, the trading house. Do, 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 do. What? Ah, oh, for fuck's sake, hold on. Uh, this place is uh, the merchant guild's like main base and my shop will be a part of this guild so I came to um give them the paperwork oh okay we heal super quickly in this place nice so just going inside a building like that it's kind of all right what do you have to say why the hell are you everywhere oh looks like we meet again at all Uh, why are you in a place like this? I was coming with um, Kadisha. Uh, why the hell are you here? <laughs> oh, I came to report as the leader or the uh, the guy that oversees Dandelion. Uh, to make it like run smoothly, we've got to become friendly with the guild, or I guess like get involved with the guild. Uh, you can just leave jobs like this to me. Oh, whisper. Uh, that's right, adult. You be careful of those church nights. And ever since you infiltrated the prison, their movements have gotten a lot more um, vigorous, I guess. They've also added more people to this, uh, their base here and have strengthened their security it seems apparently they're even working with the guards from rome 
and strengthening their um, their like plans to capture the uh, the monstrum. What kind of organization are they? Or are they like on good times with them? Well, I guess they must be since that's this. So. Yeah, I guess it would be good for you to know this, like, now. And they're a church that focuses um, on, like, sp uh, security and also spreading the word of their religion. And that's what they are. Uh, officially, they're, like, a bunch of like devout like devotees to their religion but but apparently they like forced themselves on the church like forced the church to recognize their like establishment and there's a rumor saying that they have uh bases all over the continent Mm, but the one who like established them here in Guria was the guy that you met, that uh, Shatorar. Mm, his swordsmanship is amazing, and he's also um, he also has a really good reputation in town. Although I think you're better than him personally. <laughs> It's normal for Rome to put their guards in their, like, in their, like, related states to protect the peace. But unusually enough in Balduk, the guards and the knights of the church share this responsibility. So he planned it so that the knights would get this, um, would be left with this responsibility. The leader of the knights here. His like, uh, he's really good at politics, and he's also a schemer. He's the one you'd have to worry about most, like, if he ever gets in your way. Uh, I don't like it. You waiting? Mm, hello, Kredisha. Looks like we meet again. Looks like your shop's going well. Ah, oh, Shante-san. Ah, uh, thank you. Adol, you should remember what we just spoke about. Okay. Alright then, see you again at the shop, or at the bar, I guess. Alright then, let's continue our invest- or our, like, sightseeing round this uh district all right what's over here this looks kind of like a stage or a stadium or something oh, okay it is it's like a yeah an outside stadium mm, on the day on like the uh anniversary of the war being won there's a lot of like plays that get shown here. Oh look at all there's uh there's like a big actor or like a performer. Oh pff, he's just juggling. Uh sorry I got kind of excited there. I really like looking at performers. Uh have you seen much of that? Yeah if you you kind of do if you do a lot of traveling. Uh, I've even <laughs> I've even seen them on like deserted islands. I'm trying to think if there was someone like that in Year's Eight, probably. Uh, yeah. Mm, aren't they amazing? How much do they have to practice to be able to do that? I wonder. Anyway, there's also something else over here. If we talk to this guy. Hello. 
Maybe not. What the heck? There's a question mark here. That usually means there's some kind of quest thing you can do. Maybe it's up here? Probably. It's odd. Hmm. Right, there we go. Oh, there's a treasure here. And then over here. Ah, a scene. Okay, a scenic place. Good. You discovered a new location. The Theatre Square. The reason I'm playing as Kirisha is because she's actually faster at moving than me an adult. Or maybe it's just my imagination actually, because she's a lot smaller than him, so maybe it looks like she moves faster. No, it looks like we got something else over here now. We got 620 HP thanks to that equipment. Oh damn it, I wanted to get the save point, whatever. What about the save point? It's terrible, there's a monster. It's that murderer. Tuck it. Uh, Hawk. Adol. Yeah, let's go. Oh shit. It looks like we finally cornered you, Hawk. To think you'd finally show yourself in broad daylight after... Uh, like... Going about your business sneakily at night. Surround him. Oh, they've got both guys. They've got the church next to him. Oh, I was wondering what it was when I came to look. And then when I come to look, it's one. To think there'd be someone outrageous enough to create a stir in them right outside of our base. Uh, on account of justice, I guess I shall uh, assist you, or we shall assist you. Uh, I, I can't tell if he's saying thank you or like not. Yeah, I think he's saying thank you. It looks like you reached the end of your fate or your destiny, whatever. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> He's stronger than the rumors. Show him the pride of the knights. Don't get um beaten by the likes of the Kaijin. So this is the power of time. <laughs> Looks like it's your fate that's ended. Oh shit, Adol. Who are you guys? Oh, you guys are. <laughs> I waited for this. Oh shit. You waited? You would have killed him if I hadn't stopped you. Hmm. <laughs> I thought I'd get in contact you <laughs> with you doing this instead of or when I found out you weren't in the shop or the bar. You're as, um, extreme as always. Hmm. Crimson King, shut up and listen to me. I've even- I found you, a uh, route to get into the prison.
Mm, you're searching, uh, you're searching the prison, aren't you? I've also got a bit of interest in that. You got pr interest in the prison? Or where's the entrance? I'll ask this one there. Oh, the entrance is inside the knight's base, huh? That was right. Huh. I'll attract their attention and, like, mess them up. I'll uh, draw their attention and mess them up a bit for you. Huh. While I'm doing that, you guys look for the bronze statue in the garden on the east side of the base. There should be a mechanism there to open the entrance. What are you planning? Uh, we don't know if he's what he's saying is true. You can shut up, uh, <laughs> midget cat. Uh, there's no, there's no time. Oh god, she's hiding now. Oh, there they are over there. All right, let's go. <laughs> surround him! Surround him! What are we going to do, Adam? This is already a, um, an insane plan. And we don't even know if there's actually a hidden thing there. Uh, this is a good chance, let's go, or it can't be helped, let's go. <laughs> For saying there's no other choice, you're pretty, um, you look like you're having plenty of fun, don't you? Or something like that. Oh crap, we like completely locked in. I kinda wanted to um mess around somewhere else and go and do some side quests. But for now, I think I'm gonna end off for now. So I will see you guys in the next one.